I think the entire season and even going back to spring training, you know, I've talked about it a lot. I, I just feel like the focus of the group, the preparation of the group on a daily basis has been really strong. And, you know, it's, it's great now that we're starting to get more consistent results. Some guys that got off to a little bit of a slow start are, are slowly but surely kind of coming around. Um, but I think it all comes to back to we're just making better swing decisions as a group night in and night out, and, and that's allowing us to, to put some big numbers on the board. This team is 9-0 and when they score five runs or more. What does that stat mean to you? I guess it would pitch well. <laughs> um, you know, we're trying to be the most complete team we can be. And, uh, you know, I think, you know, so far – we're very early in the season, um, and I, but I think in every aspect we're we're showing signs of being able to do a lot of different things and win games in different ways. Whether it's with our defense, our base running, our swinging the bats, obviously our pitching, both starting and relieving. We want to be as complete as we can be, and that's what we're working at every day. You've got Jose Trevino behind the plate again, catching Garrett Cole. What did you like best about how they worked together last time out? Um, I guess just that it was seamless um, when he went in there, you know. As I've talked a lot with you guys, I have a ton of confidence in both our catchers. Um, I feel like our staff as a whole has a ton of confidence in both those guys. And I feel like, uh, you know, the the synchronization between our pitchers and our catchers right now it has been something that's been a real strength for us. And, and uh, you know, with, with – Hosey and with Kyle, it's just, you know, two guys that I feel like were in very good hands back there night in and night out. You knocked on wood during the homestand about the errorless streak. Now 13 games without committing an error out there. Yep, there you go again. Uh, who has pressed you the most defensively on this team? Whew. Um, I'm really excited about the way DJ has looked, um, you know, especially being able to go back over to third base as much as he's been able to do. Um, I feel like he's moving and throwing better than, than he was at any time last year. That's been really encouraging to see. Um, uh, you know, obviously what Kiner brings and his athleticism in the middle of the diamond, I feel like we're in really good hands behind the plate with our tandem back there. Um, so, and then, you know, the anchor over there at first, you know, Riz just kind of brings it all together, I feel like. So um, we, we've worked hard on our defense. They've, they've worked hard. It's a priority. And, uh, you know, so far it's been good, but it's, it's April.